adhere upon the farewell advice of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. A hadith authentic and related by Tirmidhi and Abi Dawood. May Allah be pleased with all of them. That it was narrated by Al-Irbad ibn Sariya. May Allah be pleased with him. That the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, he said the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam delivered a speech by which our hearts were filled with fear and our eyes were overflown with tears. So we said, O oh, Messenger of Allah, it seems like this is your farewell speech. So advice. He sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, I advise you to fear Allah and to listen and to obey to your rulers and listen and obey. Even if a slave were to become your ruler, verily he, he amongst you who lives long, meaning long enough, will see great controversies. So hold upon my sunnah. And the sunnah of the rally guided Khalifas. And those are Abu Bakr, Umar, Uthman, and Ali. May Allah be pleased with all of them. So adhere upon my sunnah. And the sunnah of the rally guided Khalifas. Bite upon it with your moral teeth. Hold upon it stubbornly. Clinch to it. Don't let it go. He sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, be aware of newly invented matters into the religion. For every newly introduced matter into the deen is bid'ah, and every bid'ah is misguidance. The Prophet ﷺ shows the severity of the situation. A fitan will come, and if you're not wholeheartedly holding upon the sunnah of Rasulullah ﷺ, you will be willing to compromise and give it up entirely or part of it. The servant will be willing to accept bid'ah and follow them, and his heart indeed will become lenient towards the bid'ah. Either he will follow it, or he will love it, or he will defend it. Or he will do all of them with billah. And therefore the Prophet Sallallahu said, clinch to it. And he Sallallahu another hadith war mentions that this matter will become again strange. So give glad tidings to the strangers. And those who are the strangers, their affairs will be fixed. And they will hold upon the deen when the rest will leave it. Or will become crooked with billah, or abandon the sunan of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Adhere upon the command of Rasulullah. Fear Allah the Exalted, and know that the Prophet وسلم, left for us a safe haven. If we hold upon it, we will be saved. He وسلم, said, Indeed, I'm leaving among you that which if you hold fast to them, you shall never be misguided after me. The Book of Allah and my Sunnah.